in the operating room. And I'm here to show you how to set up the cell saver if that's something you need to do for your case just to get it going before perfusion gets here. So two things you will need. Um, the cell saver machine first lives in the back of room five and six and you can get it out. You'll need your um, bucket here and your tubing. Also, um, there's a button to turn on in the back of the machine to get it started once you plug it in. So that would be right down here. So that's your on-off machine. So this, is, this can be a little tricky to uh, get into the holder here. So once you filter, you open it and you grab it, you want to pull this, pull this back a little, line these little um, things up together, this little ledge. This pulls back, slips right in. Should be nice and sturdy then. The next thing you do, just match up your colors, yellow, to this gas back here, vacuum. And super easy, just like any other suction tubing or tubing that we might have. Let's just go ahead and open it. Slip it right on. And then step two. Right back there. Okay, so step number two. You need to get a bag of um, normal saline, mm -hmm. usually 30,000 units of heparin inject. Uh, you'll need your tubing that goes to the field, so just open that up to the field. This is what the package looks like, okay? So just normally do what you would normally do when you open it up to the field, and it's in the field, and they're going to toss you all this stuff, as in the spike and the connector for our canister here. So this is all coming off the field now. Go Go ahead and spike. We're gonna say there's heparin in there even though there's not today. And then this will go over here. Doesn't matter which one, pick any one. And there you go. Should be ready to work. Suction will be on the field to the end of this. 